What's up, Scorpio, and welcome to my channel. I hope all of my beautiful, powerful, handsome Scorpios out there are doing well. So, Scorpio, we're about to pull some messages through music volume one, baby, okay? And we're going to see what messages through music someone wants to let you know, Scorpio. So, if anything resonates for you, don't forget to like this video. Subscribe to my channel. Also, comment. Let Blue Flame know what's going on. And if you're interested in a personal, you guys, I will have my email in the description box below, okay? All right, Scorpio, let's go. All right, messages through music for my Scorpio. What messages through music do you have? All right, Scorpio, we have Dreezy featuring T-Pain, okay? Someone Scorpio was saying, baby, they'll do anything just to get close to you at this time, Scorpio, okay? So this is someone, Scorpio, I feel like ain't been no physical contact, you know what I'm saying? Like, I feel like you've distanced yourself from this person, right? And I feel like at this time, Scorpio, this person's like, man, I'll do anything, you know what I'm saying, to get close to Scorpio, like to be in Scorpio energy. Like someone really is like missing your energy, Scorpio, okay? With something that you gave this person, you know what I'm saying? This person is saying, Scorpio, they'll do anything, baby, to get close to you, okay? All right, messages from my Scorpio spirit. Tell us more. All right, Scorpio, we have here. Fantasia, okay? Truth is, Scorpio, okay? So this is Scorpio, someone who, uh, the truth is, Scorpio, this person has never gotten over you, okay? So for some of you guys, this person that you are in separation with, okay, not talking to, someone that you broke up with, I feel like, Scorpio, this person made you feel like they ain't give a damn about you, Scorpio. I'm just gonna keep it real, okay? But this is someone, Scorpio, like, and I feel like even when you see this person or... If you've recently seen this person, like a picture of them, maybe even if you've seen them like face to face, like they could have acted like real nonchalant, like you know what I'm saying? They weren't messed up about you or they didn't care. But the truth is, Scorpio, this person has not gotten over you. They have not gotten over this connection, okay? And this person, Scorpio, they saying they would do anything to get close to you, okay? What's, I'm hearing that song. This is an old song. Just to be close. Just to be close. To you, girl. I don't know who's seen that, but that's what the hell just came to my mind, Scorpio. Okay, that's what I just channeled. All right, messages from my Scorpio spirit. Tell us more. Messages through music for my Scorpio Holy Spirit. Tell us more about this. All right, Scorpio. Ooh, okay. And then we have Aaliyah, if your girl only knew, okay? So for some of you guys, you could have been involved or somebody involved you in a third-party situation, okay? Or Scorpio, you could have been dealing with someone and maybe you knew this person had, like, a boyfriend or you knew this person had a girlfriend, okay? But the truth is, Scorpio, this person thought of you as they pussy fair. You know what I'm saying, Scorpio? You was putting down on this person, Scorpio, okay? This person was loving. You know what I'm saying? They missing your good loving, but they feel like, Scorpio, you was a they personal pussy fair. You know what I'm saying? Like, that, that thing right there, Scorpio, shit, they ain't want nobody else to have that, okay? But I feel like this energy of if your girl only knew, okay? This is someone, Scorpio, that knew, you know what I'm saying? They they knew whoever they was dealing with, like, had someone else, okay? And they saying if this person knew, they would not want them talking to you, okay? So, for some of you guys, you could have been dealing with someone that had someone else, okay? Like I said, a third-party situation. And for some of you guys, the reason why this person had been communicating to you while you haven't talked to them is because this third party knows about you, Scorpio, okay? They know, Scorpio, that you was this person's personal pussy fair, you know what I'm saying, like, they was sprung, that's what I'm trying to say, thank you, spirit, this person was sprung, Scorpio, off your shit, you know what I'm saying, that shit was good, whether you're man or woman, whatever it was, Scorpio, they was sprung, you was a dick fairy, they pussy fairy, whichever way, okay, and it was like, this person, Scorpio, whoever they was dealing with, it was like, they saw a difference in this person, or even, like, the, the sex, like, they felt that difference, you know what I'm saying, they was like, hold on, who the fuck this person been dealing with, so this person, Scorpio, the truth is, this person ain't never got over this connection. For some of you guys, this third party knows about you, and they know, Scorpio, they were sprung off of that good love, and they was getting from your ass, okay? I just got a couple more messages. We're going to pull some little tarot here to clarify these, okay? Messages from my Scorpio spirit. I love you, Scorpio. And this is someone, Scorpio, I feel like they needed to do some healing, you know what I'm saying? They needed to do some reflecting on the inside, so this is someone I feel like they had to go into hermit mode to be by themselves to reflect on this connection, you know what I'm saying? This is someone who I feel like 
ran from the truth. You know what I'm saying? They ran from those feelings and emotions. They ran from admitting to themselves like they really loved you or even had feelings and emotions, whatever it was, okay? I feel like this person had to take time to self-reflect on some things. And it was like once they did, they realized the truth is, Scorpio, that they never got over you in this connection the whole time they've been playing themselves. You know what I'm saying? Bullshitting with themselves, trying to make themselves believe, Scorpio, they didn't love you. Trying to make them believe, trying to make them trying to make themselves believe, Scorpio, like you didn't mean nothing to them. This connection was nothing. Look at this, Scorpio. I can't make it up. I split the deck, the eight of cups, okay? A lot of you guys, you walked away from this connection, okay? You were disappointed. You know what I'm saying? You were sad. You didn't want to walk away from this person. But I feel like there was something hidden. Remember I said there, there could have been you guys, this person could have involved you in a third-party situation, okay? And I feel like for some of you guys, this is what you found out. You could have found out about this third-party situation, you know what I'm saying? And that's when you decided to walk away, turn your back on this person. I feel like when you did that, this person tried to convince themselves, like, they weren't fucked up about Scorpio walking away. They weren't messed up about, you know what I'm saying, not talking to Scorpio, not being with Scorpio, because they can go replace Scorpio. They can go be with somebody else. It's another Scorpio out there, right? And this person thought that. They thought they thought Scorpio, but shit, at the end of the day, they realized, like, there's no one else that can compare to Scorpio. You know what I'm saying? And the truth is, this is what they're realizing. Messages from my Scorpio spirit. Tell us more. Why does Scorpio have to walk away? Tell us about the Eight of Cups, Holy Spirit. Who walked away and why? Page of Wands, okay? Because I feel like this person, Scorpio, all they came towards you with lots of passion. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is a very passionate connection that you share with this person. Like I said, lots of sex, lots of chemistry that you share, but it was like this person, look how she holding that wand. Like, that's how they always came to you, just with their dick in their hand. You know what I'm saying? Always just in this sexual energy. Like, and being around this person, Scorpio, you could have had a lot of fun with this person. Like, you know, it was very childlike. Like, y'all could have did things, like, just laughed and had a good time together, but it was like, but at the end of the day, how this person out, like, it was how this person came to you, and I feel like you got tired of this person always coming to you, you know what I'm saying, in this type of energy, always just with fun, but it was like, that's all you were going to get, like, this wasn't someone that can give you stability, you know what I'm saying, someone that you can grow old with, it may have been someone you saw that with, but at the end of the day, when you realize, you know what I'm saying, this person really didn't have nothing to offer you, and then the whole time, this person was lying to you, possibly about a third party, you know what I'm saying, about even being involved with someone else, tell us more, Holy Spirit. What messages do you have for my Scorpios? And I feel like for a lot of you guys, you were dealing with a narcissist as well. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm looking like how they're looking at this one. You know what I'm saying? Like somebody who, who always, like, people admire this person. But I feel like they were stuck on themselves. You know what I'm saying? Like this is someone who kind of was like that. Like, this ain't the king of wands, but this is how this is the energy I'm getting from this card. Like, that player, you know what I'm saying? Like, somebody that was so stuck in themselves, they felt like, well, shit. You know what I'm saying? The Scorpio ain't gonna mess with me. Like, shit, I can go get another Scorpio. You know what I'm saying? I can go do this. I can do that. Like, they thought they was that person. Like, they can just drop you, Scorpio, like it was nothing. Like, drop you like it was a, like you was a bad habit. You know what I'm saying? Go find your replacement and be just fine. And the whole time, I feel like this person's fine out the hard way. Like, nah, player, when you get with Scorpio, like, there's only one Scorpio out here. You know what I'm saying? And you're not going to find nothing else like you get from Scorpio. You're not going to get that love. You don't get that nurturing. You don't get nobody that's going to ride for you like Scorpio going to ride for you, okay? And look at the bottom of the deck, the fool. It's still here. I feel like Scorpio, this person wants to take some type of leap of faith with you. See, I feel like in the past, Scorpio, this Aquarius doesn't have to be, okay? We got uh, Page of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, okay? Or an Aquarius. Someone here, I feel like, see how she just just walking, you know what I'm saying? This motherfucker at the end of the, at the cliff. You know what I'm saying? The dog barking at them. It's like, hey, hey, you, you about to fall off the cliff. And see, this person, they was in their own little world, thinking they was the man, thinking they was this big shot type person. You know what I'm saying? This person that could just have and do anything they wanted to, just living their own life. For some of you guys, you could be dealing with someone that always has, like, them, with those iPods. Or maybe someone that wears, like, a backpack purse. Or they always got some type of backpack or something on. Somebody could have a brown dog here. Or someone here is, like, always on their phone, like, listening to music or something. Like, this person was, like, in their own little world. And I feel like they was the fool. You know what I'm saying? They was exactly what this car said. They was a damn fool. And they wasn't paying attention to nothing. You know, feeling 
and thinking they had everything and then now Scorpio the truth is now this person's realized Scorpio these feelings and emotions that they have for you were real you know what I'm saying and they have not gotten over this connection they told themselves Scorpio they was not messed up about you you know what I'm saying but they realized Scorpio they ain't gotten over you you know what I'm saying now they don't know what to do okay this is someone Scorpio that could have been in this eight of scores energy okay Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius doesn't have to be. See, fear, it was something that was holding this person back. It was some type of fear. Maybe this person was fearing you guys rejecting them, fearing. So it, it was something that was holding this person back. Like, they were blinded to a lot of things, okay? Remember I said this person just living their life, just walking around aimlessly, just like a little airhead, you know what I'm saying? Not knowing where they going, just, just doing whatever, okay? And I feel like now this person, you know what I'm saying, now I feel like they, you could have been dealing with someone, Scorpio, that also could have been very insecure with themselves. Like, they lack confidence. Like, they could have seen you, Scorpio, as someone that was, like, very confident, very outgoing. Someone that knew exactly what you wanted in life. Whether you were doing that, you know what I'm saying? Whether you were already walking in your purpose or doing what you wanted to, it didn't matter. Like, you knew, Scorpio. Like, you could have told this person, like, you were sharing your dreams and goals and, and admirate, you know what I'm saying, like dreams and goals and, and things that you wanted to accomplish in your life. And then this person was sitting here, you know, like you have a conversation with somebody, you be telling them, yeah, I want to do this and I want to do this. And then kind of like they turn and then they ain't have shit to say, right? So I feel like this person lacked confidence. They didn't have that same confidence that you had in yourself, right? So this person lacked confidence in the past for you. I feel like to even explore like the what if, like, what 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 would this relationship be like if I was with Scorpio? Like, what would this mean? Like, this person, they didn't want to explore that. But now, Scorpio, they got the confidence to take that blindfold off. You see this person with this blindfold on? They got the confidence now to peek outside that blindfold and be like, okay, what is this, okay? They realized that, like, whatever they were fearing, like, it was just fears. It was their own insecurities getting in their way, okay? This is someone who I feel like allowed... They allowed themselves to block this connection or allow someone else to block this connection. This is someone who was also, they didn't move forward in this connection because I feel like they were unsure. Like, I feel like maybe this person didn't feel like they were good enough for you, Scorpio. That's, that's the energy I'm getting, you know what I'm saying? Because if you lack confidence, if you realize that you were just fearing something, or you realize that you were afraid of the outcome, you know what I'm saying? Like, you really, you lack confidence in yourself, okay? So I feel like this person, like I said, you were very confident. You knew exactly what you wanted, but see, this person did not score for you. They lack that same confidence. They lack that same integrity. They lack that same... They lack that same structure, you know what I'm saying? Like to, to stay focused and to go toward their dreams. This is someone they ain't really had structure. They just kind of, like I said, roamed around aimlessly with no direction, you know what I'm saying, in life. Like, see, Scorpio, you structure. You got to you gotta be able to, to to have a lot of structure, to have a lot of focus, to have a lot of of drive, you know what I'm saying, to be able to accomplish things. See, this person didn't have that. And I feel like it, 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 it stemmed from their childhood because they didn't have people that motivated them to be the best they could be, Scorpio. A lot of us, we ain't really had nobody to motivate us. But see, we had enough in us to be our own self-starters, okay, to be our own motivators, okay? But see, some people, they need to have somebody cheering them on. They need somebody to get them started. And a lot of us, we have to realize, like, shit, if we ain't get our own self started, we want nothing going to get done, okay? All right, Scorpio, so we have a Gemini here. We got a uh, Cancer Scorpio, a Pisces. We got Aquarius. So let's see what other signs we're talking about, Scorpio. We have, ooh, Heavy Sash, Virgo, and Pisces. And Scorpio, we have Heavy Capricorn, Taurus, and Cancer. All right, Scorpio, I love, I love, I love you guys. Hello to anyone that's new. Just watching, anybody that's returning, all my new BFFs, okay, and all my other BFFs that's been rocking with me. What's up, family? I love you guys, and until next time, Scorpio, stay blessed. We on number four, Scorpio.